Hi everybody, so I am recording the Jaclyn Hill Fall Favorites tag. If you guys haven't heard of Jaclyn Hill, um, she is literally just the best YouTuber ever. She's so funny and witty and amazing. Um, I talk about her all the time. So if you haven't heard of her, I'll leave her link down below. You need to check out her channel. She is literally the best YouTuber out there. Um, so this is the tag that she made up for fall. Um, she loves fall like everybody else. I don't really love fall. I like fall, but I don't like winter. So like the fact that fall's here gives me anxiety that winter is coming, which is ridiculous but winter is so bad. Such a hard time for me. Um, but I do like fall. But summer is my favorite season. I enjoy being hot. So the first question um, is your favorite fall candle. And I have two, but I will start out by saying I'm not like a candle snob. Like, I prefer cheap candles just because I'm generally a cheap person. And I find that cheap candles work just as well. Like, I'm not trying to spend $22 on a candle. I just think, like, that's insane. They smell great, but ugh. This candle is... Five dollars or under. I actually think it's under five dollars. Um, it's from the brand Walnut Avenue from Walmart, and it's in the scent Classic Flannel. It smells so amazing. It's kind of like a woodsy scent. Like it has like woody accents. I feel like I have no idea what I'm talking about. I'm just like trying to sell and smart, but. Um, the scent is described as a classic, clean smell with juniper. Um, I'll leave like the exact description down below. Because I can't describe scents at all. But it just smells so good. It really does smell like fall. And it just smells up your whole house. Like when I walk in my foyer um, to get into my apartment, even if it's not burning, and I had it burning earlier in the day, you can smell it. Um, so that is my favorite. I don't have the one to show you. And I'll leave the exact name of it down below. But it's also from Walmart. I've never seen it in a candle form. I've always seen the little wax burners. But it's called like Autumn Harvest or Fall Harvest or something. Um, it has like... Um, if you would look for it, it's like the little scents, like the little cubes, and it has like gourds in it, like on the front, like uh, some gourds and pumpkin, that's like the picture that goes with it. It smells such like a perfect fall day. They're really good. Um, I do want to say with this one, if you want to find it, and there's other really, really good fall scents, this brand was by Febreze at my Walmart. It wasn't with the other candles, which makes no sense. Um, so definitely check them out. They're under $5, and they're completely worth it. And the little wax scents, scents are like $2, and they work just as well. The second is your favorite lip color. It's actually what I have on now. This is the lip duo that I showed in my um, Cool Tone Purple Smoky Eye look, which I'll leave down, link down below also. Um, but it's just a really pretty matte brown that I've been enjoying, and this is, I have the liner on, um, it's the Urban Decay 24-7 Glide on Lip Pencil in the color Naked 2. Um, I just find that this helps my lip color last even longer, and the lip color that I have on is the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the color Abu Dhabi. Um, I've talked about this a lot in a lot of my videos, and you can see it on my lips. It's just such a beautiful color. It smells and tastes like vanilla, not that I'm like licking my lips, and it, it's just so long lasting, like it lasts for hours and you just don't have to worry about it, um, and it, I, I'm proud of myself for not being the classic plummy lip that, and vampy lip that I'm sure everybody's going to talk about, um, the third favorite fall tag question is the favorite fall drink, I love, if you go to Sheets and you get their hot chocolate. Um, they have the Ghirardelli like hot chocolate and you can get white chocolate's my favorite. So I get white chocolate, hot chocolate. And at my sheets, they used to have the option. They don't anymore, but I get pumpkin flavoring in it. Um, but they don't have that as an option. So whenever I go up to the counter, I ask them to add pumpkin flavoring so they can do that for you. It's just so delicious and perfect. Um, I will say though, last night I got that and they put they're like, oh, do you still want the vanilla, like, syrup in it? And I said, yeah, because I assumed that that's what they did anyways, but it's not. Don't get it with the vanilla syrup because it does not taste good. The white chocolate, hot chocolate with pumpkin spice flavoring in it is amazeballs. Like, it's so good. You need it. Um, the next question is the favorite blush, and it's the blush that I have on now. Um, this is the Milani Romantic Rose Blush. Um... Milani brush it, blushes are just one point. They're so beautiful. Um, it's just a really pretty dusty, rosy color, and I think it's super natural looking. I will do a little swatch my finger for you. And, like, the packaging is so cute. I feel like it's not, like, showing up on my finger. Let's see, let's see that. 
But yeah, just such a gorgeous color. Like, I absolutely love it for fall time. And those, like, dusty colors always look good. Um, favorite clothing item. I think scarves are the best fall staple. They are cheap. You can wear them in so many different ways. They're available everywhere. And it's just, they're, they're amazing. Um, I have so many scarves. It's insane. And, um, I... I'm going to start cleaning out my closet. I have I have two bedrooms in my apartment. And the closet and my makeup room is like all my clothing items. But then I have so many scarves that I literally have them hanging in my other closet in my bedroom. So I'm thinking like on this, um, my shoe shelf, I want to get like those little um, prongs. Or not prongs, you know what I mean? Like hanging things to like put on here. Um, to hang my scarves off. I just have three of my favorite scarves to show you guys, but I probably literally have over 50 scarves. It's absolutely ridic ridiculous. Um, this is an oldie but goodie, you know, when crosses used to be, like, so in. Um, I really love this one, and I love this flower one, I just think that. And this one I got from Forever 21 probably five or six years ago. Um, I got a couple of them in this color and they're just such good quality and they're soft and beautiful and oh wait that's the is that the back? How do I wear this? I think you can wear it either way but I think I generally wear it this way. But yeah I just think scarves can pull a whole outfit look together and even if you're being casual scarves make you look like you tried. Like if you put on a scarf, a t-shirt, a leather jacket, a pair of jeans and some cute flats like literally that's nothing. Like that's the comfiest outfit ever and you look put together. So I love those and I look forward to buying more. Um, favorite fall movie I would have to say um, while I do really like Hocus Pocus, I think Halloween Town is my absolute favorite. I just remember watching that growing up, and I always make sure to turn that on the TV whenever I see it on ABC Family. Um, favorite fall TV show? I would have to say The Walking Dead and Now the Fear of the Walking Dead are my favorite. I love them. Um, there's something that my family and I, you know, just spend time doing. Joe and I do it. Actually, tonight we're going to watch Fear of the Walking Dead. What time is it? Oh, I have like an hour until it starts, so I have to like, I still, I mean, still haven't even had dinner yet, so, but I just think they're really good shows, I really like that whole zombie-esque theme, um, and they're good, so if you haven't checked out Walking Dead, you definitely should, I, I've also been liking that show Mr. Robot, um, but that's the first, this is its first season, um, the favorite Thanksgiving food, I, um, this is what Jacqueline said too, but stuffing is my jam, like, I love stuffing, I crave it, and even, like, even if you make... I'm getting hungry. <laughs> I should eat dinner before this. But I feel like if you eat stuffing on a non-Thanksgiving day, it still doesn't taste as good. Like, I think that Thanksgiving turkey or Thanksgiving um, stuffing is the best ever, and I love it. And my aunt just makes it so good, and it's, like, super moist, and she'll give me, like, a huge bag of it to take home, and it's just, like, it's perfect. You, like, wake up in the night, middle of the night, and you're, like, craving some stuff, and you, like, get it, because it's the best cold. I think cold stuffing is delicious. And the final quest question is your favorite Halloween costume, but Jacqueline said that it's, like, your favorite Halloween costume that you've, like, worn. Um, my favorite costume, and I don't know why this sticks out to me, but as soon as she said that question, like, I instantly knew. One year, I was... 101 Dalmatians was my favorite Disney movie, and I was a Dalmatian for Halloween. I don't have any pictures to show you guys where I would, like, put pictures up. And I think, um, that was, um, holidays were always, like, ruined for me as a child. Like, there was always just a family member that I had that ruined holidays and made them miserable. And not that Halloween's, like, a super big ho holiday, but, like, anything like that, any special something, were always ruined. And I think that Halloween, like, I don't remember, but I think that Halloween sticks out to me so much is because it was a really, really good Halloween. I remember, like, I was with my memu um, and my family, and it was just, like, super happy. So I don't think it was necessarily a costume. I think it was just, like, having a positive holiday. But I was just so cute. I remember, like, my little costume, and I had, like, my little face paint and, like, polka dots, like, my mom did my makeup, and it was so much fun. Um... And I remember this night, it's so funny, I remember, I think it's Tim McGraw, that song, like, I swear, and it, like, by the moons and the stars and the sky, or, like, whatever that is, I think that's Tim McGraw, but I remember listening to that song on that night, and I spent the night at my grandma's, so it was just a really positive night, so I think that's more <laughs> than the costume, but yeah, so thank you guys, everybody, or thank you guys, everybody.
Thank you guys so much for watching. If you make videos, I would love for you to, like, let me know down below if you do this tag so I can watch it. Or if you want to leave in the comments below, like, answer the questions. I love to read them. And if Jaclyn Hill happens, because she said if you, like, tweet at her that you, like, if you make these videos, if she, like, if you happen to watch my videos, Jaclyn, I love you. I think you are the best, one of the best people out there in the world, and I really, really admire you. So, again, if you guys haven't watched the videos, please check it out, and I will talk to you next video. Have a great day. Bye.